Hi, welcome to Rate This Gear. Today I'll be doing a video review of the Tidal Perfect Punch Pro. So this device here is uh, pretty cool. I really wanted to uh, try it out, see if this is something that I would hold on to. Um, and basically what this device does is it teaches you how to punch perfectly on a heavy bag. So it helps you not get any injuries and things of that nature. And uh, I'm going to give you a close up. I'm going to talk about the device. I'm going to take one off. It's got this Velcro strap. You know, you put your hand in it, grab it, wrap it around, and kind of start hitting the heavy bag with it. So, um, this particular device, uh, the construction of it, it's it's all very, it's decent quality plastic. I mean, it's, it's, it's hard quality plastic. It's got this Velcro strap that wraps all the way around your wrist. Um, the Velcro strap is pretty good. It's got this um, target area, I guess, if you call it, or maybe like a buffer between the bag or whatever you're punching, and this plastic here. It's got this soft uh, cushion like uh, grip bar. Uh, it's got a, a little pad here as well, just in case maybe if your hand slips or if you lose uh, a grip for, for whatever reason, you don't slam it against the, the plastic inside here. Uh, so with that said, the construction of it, it's not the best uh, quality. It's, it looks very, very cheap. Uh, actually, the grip bar is taped up. Um, this thing does come off here. So maybe you could wash it or whatever, but this, um, on, on the other one, this thing is, is glued on. So I think this at some point maybe will come off. It actually started to come off already. So, you know, it's a very, very cheap design. Now, it's supposed to teach you to punch perfectly uh, every time. And basically what this does is, and I use this on the heavy bag for several, several training sessions to try this out. Um, while you're punching it, I mean, if you're hitting it, it, it will, you will hit correctly while using this device in the sense that it will land on this circle. Um, target area here. However, your fist is placed in this type of a position while you're holding on to the grip bar. And that's incorrect. I mean, you're not going to be punching straight all on, you know, all the way on your fist here in this area, right? You're kind of going to be punching up like this. So this is very incorrect. And if you're beginning uh, boxing, you're going to use this as a guide to punch and learn proper technique. This is definitely the wrong device and I wouldn't recommend it. Um, it, you know, it, you, once you strap it up, it does provide good, uh, you know, wrist support. But there is a drawback to this device in the sense that when I was hitting it uh, lighter, uh, it was it was holding up fine. But once I started it hitting it heavier, and even though I had it strapped really really tight, what happened was it would start to slip. You know, it start to move, and you know, you could potentially even uh, injure yourself uh, with this. So I wouldn't recommend really, if you do happen to want to buy this, uh, is to really hit it hard. And certain punches that I was throwing, I wasn't really able to do it correctly. I mean, I was able to throw pretty good straight shots, some hooks. Uppercuts were a little bit weird, especially if you started to throw uh, harder. I used an uppercut bag. This thing would kind of move around, and it was a little bit uncomfortable. So with that said, I mean, this device... Although it, it looks good, and I mean, I could see why, what you could use this for. I mean, this device you could use it for if you have a small injury uh, on your hands and you still want to work out, you could put this on and kind of beat the bag a little bit for cardio type of work. Uh, or if you're a professional fighter, you happen to get injured and you need to, be, you need to stay out of your shape, you could use this. But one of the things I will say is when I was hitting this on a heavy bag, and uh, I tried it on two different types. So there's one with a very strong, like a synthetic leather that a lot of the bags use now. And I tried it on a leather bag. The leather bag was taking it pretty good. But when I was using it like on a synthetic leather, it started leaving these rings all over the place. And, uh, you know, I kind of had to stop using it when I was hitting it a little bit harder because I was afraid that it would potentially damage the bag. Although I don't think it would. Uh, I haven't used it enough to really uh, find out if it would. And, uh, you know, if you are going to be using this device and you're using it in the gym, maybe, you know, a gym owner might have might take an issue with that. And once they start seeing a lot of these circles, they might be afraid that you might damage the bag. Um, so as far as um, the price point, I mean, this device is on the expensive side for what it is. Uh, it's it's around like 60 bucks, $60. So I think it's very, very expensive for, for what it is. It's very cheaply made. I don't think it will teach you how to punch correctly. Um, you can't really use this too hard, otherwise it starts to move around all over the place. And um, you know, this is not something I would recommend, unless, like I said, you're trying to uh, work out with an injury of some sort on your hands. But other than that, even at that, that price point, you know, it's not worth it. So I think this is uh, was a cool idea, but this is not something that I would recommend. So I hope you've enjoyed this review. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. I always have something cool on. So thanks for watching.